It was definitely nice to get off to a good start like I did today. I was running a little hot yesterday after the round with, uh, with the way it ended, but to uh, come out of the gates and birdie, I think it was three of my first four holes, uh, it, was, it felt nice. I don't think this is a golf course that you can really try and overpower. You just try and put yourself in good positions. My only goal today was to give myself 18 looks, just hit as many greens as I can and try and let my putter do the work. But uh, when I teed off the first five, six holes, I was hitting it good and gave myself plenty of looks, and my putter seemed to back that up as well. It was just a bad swing I made on made on 12. You just can't miss it right there with all the trees there. But um, I was uh, I was still a little disappointed with my bogey on seven today, and the par fives really didn't treat me all that well today. So that's something I'm looking forward to cleaning up. But I got out of uh, got out 12 with uh, with a five, which felt like a birdie almost with the spot I was in. So I'm gonna try and kind of tidy up my game a little bit and see how the weekend goes. I've known Eugene for a couple of years uh, from the national team program and just from playing competitive golf and playing with you know just a bunch of junior golf and amateur golf with him so it's nice to see him playing well as, uh, playing well as, as he is and uh, I'm looking forward to the next couple of days with with him and some of the other guys at the top of the leaderboard. Same as the last couple of days for sure it's just you just try and put yourself in good position out here and gotta let the putter do the talking really it's just these greens are getting firmer faster and they're big greens so you're gonna have some long putts and you're just gonna have to be on with the putter to really really play well.